All right, let's be real. When was the last time you tried to do everything on your own and got overwhelmed or just plain stuck? We've all been there trying to figure it out so low. But here's the thing, even the best in the world don't do it alone. Let me tell you why coaching is the secret sauce that takes you from meh or okay or good to phenomenal. Think about the greatest athletes of all time, Serena Williams, Simone Biles, Messi, my favorite, Messi, Michael Jordan, LeBron James. Why, why are they so good? What do they all have in common? Coaches. Their talent is undeniable. Like they are the best at what they do for a reason. And it's consistency, it's the mindset, all that. But even the most gifted people need someone to guide them, someone to push them and help them see what they can't see for themselves. So even the best athletes in the world, even the best CEOs, even the best whatever need coaches. And they're, they get better because they have coaches. Here's the truth. Coaches give you accountability, perspective, and strategy. They're the ones who say, hey, I see what you're capable of. You've got this potential here, and I'm not going to settle for less. I'm going to hold you to the standard, and, and I'm going to give you all the tools and make sure that you get to be the best version of yourself. Imagine if, like Serena had said, nah, I'm good. I don't need a coach. Crazy, right? Like, could you imagine? So I've always believed that if you want to get better at something, you want to find the best person to guide you. That's what I've done. When I wanted to get better at tennis, I hired a coach and I got better. I got exponentially better. Just spending one hour with a coach focused only on me and what I couldn't see or what I didn't know, because I didn't know anything about tennis, made me that much better than all the times, like hours and hours and hours that I could have practiced on my own, because I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know what to practice. Business, when I wanted to get good at business, I hired a coach who was good at business. Even my workouts, I am a, was a personal trainer forever. And if I wanted to get better or or you know, really like fine tune or be more motivated, I would hire a coach. I'd get stronger. I'd get faster. My nutrition would get better. Find the person who knows how to get me there. Somebody who's doing what I'm doing and that I really click with. And then I hire that person. If I want to get better at, Sp better at Spanish, it's not hard to learn Spanish if you put the time in, but I just can't do it. I, there, I just need the accountability. I need to go to class and I need for my teacher, Sandra, to be like, speak to me. She's only speaking in Spanish and only wanting an answer in Spanish. Like that's how I learn because I just am not motivated to sit on my own and do that. I don't know why. That's just how it is. But a coach will get me there. And you know, what's wild is that I've never regretted investing in a coach. Not ever, not once, because every time I come out stronger, clearer, way more confident in my path, way further ahead than if I tried to figure it out on my own. Could I have figured it out on my own? Maybe, but who knows? It would have taken a lot of time and it would have cost me way more money. The biggest investments I've ever made are in myself. Always, always, always. That's the first place that I would invest my money is in myself because I am my biggest asset in life. Even if you don't have your own business, you are your biggest asset and you should always be investing in you. Coaching is like having a personal GPS for your life. It guides you. It, recal it recalibrates you when you're off track. And it cheers you on every step of the way. It's not just about solving problems. It's about unlocking potential. Here's what a great coach can do for you. It can take, give you the clarity that transforms your path. Have you ever felt like you're spinning your wheels? Like, I'm just stuck here. I'm, I just don't know how to get out of here. A coach helps you cut through the noise and pinpoint exactly what you want. And more importantly, how to get there. Whether it's weight loss, career changes, or navigating midlife chaos. Clarity is the first step to success. 
Like you'll never achieve what you want if you don't know what it is. That's why you need to be really clear on what it is you want to succeed. You get accountability that works. Let's face it. How often do you break promises to yourself? It's so easy to break a promise to ourselves. But a coach doesn't let that slide. No, they hold you accountable in a way that's both firm, but kind and compassionate, keeping you on track when the motivation fades, because it will. It's that consistency and dedication that gets you the results that you want. And if you can't show up consistently, you can get somebody to help you show up consistently. You you can have the perspective that you can't see when you're on your own. Coaches are like your outside eyes, spotting blind spots and patterns that might be holding you back. This isn't just helpful, it's game changing. Sometimes a simple shift in perspective is all it takes to unlock major growth. When I coach people, it's so easy for me to see what's going on with them because I'm not in it. I'm removed and I'm looking from this all these different perspectives with all these different thoughts like want, on your side wanting you to succeed. And, and it's so easy for me to see what's going on in somebody's brain. Like that was when it, coaching really became a game changer is like understanding their brain, their unconscious, coaching their unconscious mind. You can't do that because you're in it and it's your unconscious mind for a reason. You're not noticing it. You don't know what it's doing until we work together. And then we really can understand why you're doing what you're doing. You get tools that create lasting change. So forget the quick fixes. A coach equips you with strategies, or a good coach equips you with strategies and habits that create real sustainable transformations. And these are tools that you'll use for a lifetime, not just while you're working with that coach. For me, the first thing I do is give my clients tools that they can use that day, that day, and forever they can use that. My goal is to work myself out of a job. If you have an issue, I want to teach you how you can solve that issue. And then if it comes up again, here's how you can solve for it on your own with these tools. And then you can apply these tools to other issues that come up. That is really my passion is to just empower and give people the tools to really create the life that they love because life is so short. And then you, you get this confidence that lights you up. There's something about having someone believe in you that feels like so good and it fuels your self-confidence like nothing else. With a coach by your side, you start showing up differently for yourself, for your family, for your future. It's just that's what happens when you know somebody's watching. When you know you get a report to somebody, when you know somebody's cheering you on, you do not want to let that person down. And it's not about what's wrong. It's about amplifying what's right and designing a life that feels amazing. And let us not forget, this isn't just for CEOs and athletes. Coaching is for anyone that wants to thrive for anyone that wants to make a change and and can't do it on their own. There's all different kinds of coaches and this is what coaches do. Okay, let's talk about why I coach and why I've invested so much in my training. Like I said before, the first thing that I invest in is myself in my education. This is why I have all these certifications and I've taken everybody's programs is because I really believe that when I make myself better and when I make my mind stronger, more powerful, that anything is possible because I'm solving my own problems. I'm looking to myself first and I'm learning as much as possible from other people that have already done that. So I don't need to waste time. I'm like, this pe- this person has the answer that I want. I'm just going to cut to the chase and learn from them. And then I take what serves me and I use that for my clients. So when a client comes to see me, I don't just have the script I'm reading. I'm like, which tool am I going to use? And then I teach you the tools. And then when something comes up for you, you're like, which tool am I going to use? That's why it's so powerful. That's the most money I've invested is in myself because I believe in myself. And I truly believe that the best investment you can make is in yourself 
and that coaching is a non-negotiable for anyone who wants to live their best midlife and beyond. I was a personal trainer for over 16 years. That's my certification and I learned as I went and along the way if I had a lull I would hire somebody to train me. I but even in personal training I took all of these trainings on how to train pre and postnatal and then specified in sports and then yoga and like I got all of those trains I did kickboxing and then I bought spin bikes like all of those in the realm of personal training because I was trying to better myself I wanted to be the best trainer that I could be and I wanted to learn everything that I could and then share it with the people that came to see me to work with me and then I became a holistic nutritionist because I wanted to learn how to heal my body through food. And I did. That was when the medical system said, girl, you need a knee replacement. Just go home and take pain medications for the next 30 years because you're too young for a full knee replacement. And this is 15 years later, no knee replacement, no, no arthritic pain. Because I thought that's crazy. There has to be another way. And then I went into the wonderful world of nutrition and healing your body through food. And I share that with my clients. I became an ener- a certified energy healer. And this is when a lot of people think of energy healing, they think of Reiki. I'm like, no, this a Reiki is like a weekend course and it's wonderful, but it's a weekend course. And you're just kind of like scratching the surface. The program that I took was a three-year program. It was the craziest program. It was through a local college, but we actually went out into the woods, like to a camp for an entire week every two months and did our studying there we had fire ceremonies and it was just so amazing we would learn like be out in nature learning from nature have it breaking down into all these different crazy learning modalities we learned in this program it wasn't just about one healing modality it was called integrative energy healing meaning They took what they felt was the best of all the healing modalities and then taught us that. So it includes all the different types. And it was so powerful. It was so powerful because we're all energy. And so all of these, what they all have in common is they're all based on healing the body as its form of being a mind, body, spirit. Because... If something comes up, that's a symptom. And Western medicine is like, oh, let's make that symptom go away. But the integrative energy healing was like, what's the root cause? What is your body trying to tell you? And it takes everything into consideration. Your thoughts, your lifestyle, your stress, your everything. And then solves for the root. It just listens. This this is your body telling you you something's wrong. And you just got to be curious and be your own advocate. And do the work. So this is like a big time investment. And I learned so much. Opened up my, of course, all the doors to like, oh my gosh, what else is possible? (laughs) I'm certified in coaching the unconscious mind with Melissa Tears, who's one of the best hypnotherapists around. Love her. And this is where everything changed. It's like, it's if people are doing something they don't want to do get the results they don't want it's because their unconscious mind is running the show and we can reprogram the brain we can reprogram your brain like that it doesn't have to take forever it doesn't have to be hard and arduous and it can be fun while we do it i studied whole healing health with mark mincola i saw him on a documentary i'm like i have to work with this man and he works that's based on the energy healing so he knows that your body has all the answers and you do muscle testing to find out for that specific person what's going on. Mind-blowing work that he does. I studied shamanism from a shaman in Peru. Actually, I studied, I forgot about this. I took a course here in Vancouver who studied, this woman studied with um, one of the best teachers of shamanism around. And listen, I you can never say you're a shaman unless you're born into it and the community decides or it picks you like you're struck by lightning. So all I can say is I, I know some 
shamanic healing techniques. I can journey. We can we can go to the different levels. It's crazy awesome. I totally forgot that I had taken that. And I apply that to when I coach people. I took all the courses from the best in the field, like Dr. Joe Dispenza. Neurons that that fire together, wire together. He's talking about how you can reprogram your brain. The epigenetics, it's not here's you're born with this, this is what you're stuck with. Nah. -uh. What do you want to, how do you want to reprogram your brain? Let's get started. You got to do the work though. That's the thing. I worked with Louise Hay, David Wolf, Gary Brecka, working with him right now. Barbara O'Neill. I love her. Everything is all natural herbs, foods, everything. I just believe that you can heal your body with your thoughts and with food. Brooke Castillo, best, you know, amazing coach, business coach out there. The list goes on and on. I've, I've, st and I take, like, I took everything that I've learned from these brilliant coaches and healers, and then I've created my ma my own magical style, like what works for me, and then I applied it to midlife women. Why? Because I'm a midlife woman, and I see how hard it is for midlife women, and how little help there is, and how few people are talking about it. Like, let's talk about all the things, because you're not the only one, sister. I guarantee if it's happening to you, it's happening to all the women. We can change it. We can make a difference. And it all starts with taking your health into your own hands. And this is why I work with the women who are ready to do the work, to learn the tools that I have to share and ready to be the solution and the star of the show in their midlife movie. So the, the women that I... I'm talking to the women that I'm reaching out to are the ones who are like, yeah, I'm ready. Let me do it. Just teach me what to do. And I'm going to do it. Midlife is like a second adolescence, but with more wisdom and sometimes more chaos. So for many women, it's like a crossroads. Kids are leaving the nest. Careers might feel stagnant and your body is throwing curveballs all over the place. So here's why this stage of life practically screams for a coach. You're rediscovering your identity. After years of putting others first, it's easy to lose sight of who you are. And a coach helps you connect with your passions, your dreams, and a sense of purpose. This isn't just about self-care. It's about self-discovery. You're navigating physical changes. So let's talk about hormones, energy shifts, and the infamous midlife belly. A coach brings expertise and practical solutions to help you feel strong, vibrant, and in control of your health. You're embracing big transitions, whether it's an empty nest, a career pivot, or relationship changes. Midlife is full of transitions. And as a coach, I can help you provide the roadmap you didn't know you needed, helping you adapt and thrive instead of just surviving. You're breaking through limiting beliefs, those little voices that say, I'm too old or it's too late for me. Coaches help you shut them down for good and reframe what's possible and remind you that this is just the beginning. We're just getting started, girl. Creating deeper connections. Midlife often brings a craving for authentic, meaningful relationships, whether it's with friends, family, or yourself. That's what I'm going through right now. I want the deepest of connections, like the deepest. And a coach helps you build the confidence and emotional intelligence to foster those connections. The truth is, midlife is a time for reinvention. You're not winding down. You are leveling up. A coach helps you see that you can have these tools that can make it all happen. Like you can see what's possible and here's the tools. Here's how you do it. Imagine looking back on this season and thinking, wow, I really became my best self, didn't I? That's the magic of coaching. There is an expression that goes, you can't solve a problem with the same thinking that caused the problem in the first place. And this is why a coach is so powerful because they have a totally different way of thinking. And this is also why people get stuck. And what I don't want is for you to be having a problem and being stuck and then not getting help with it. And a year down the road, when I come back to check on you, you're still in the same place. Nothing has changed. You're still stuck. That 
is no bueno. And I do not want that for my midlife women, not on my watch. So here's the bottom line. A coach sees the best in you and helps you step into it. They push you, they guide you, they make sure you don't give up on your dreams or give up on yourself, even when life gets tough. Because of course, it's going to get tough. So whether it's mastering midlife, starting a business, or finding yourself again, don't be afraid to invest in yourself. Because when you do, everything changes. And trust me, you are so worth it. And if this resonates with you and you've been thinking about getting a coach, let's talk. I'm here to help you live your most incredible midlife and beyond. And I've created coaches, I've created coaching options for everyone and anyone that wants to make a change. So there's no excuses. I work one-on-one with clients and I also have a membership, which is a powerful community of amazing midlife women who are creating lives they love and making midlife their best chapter yet. So if you are ready to make changes and you want to up-level your life and turn your dreams into reality, then I'm your coach. You can book your one-on-one call with me. I will put the link in the show notes. Let me leave you with this. If you are stuck with anything in your life, hire a coach because whatever you think you are, you're so much more. You're so much more than that. Thank you for listening. Always love yourself first and have an amazing day.